Okay, how to have students make the change in their Google Meet so it will translate to the language that they need. So what you're going to do is I'm going to open a Meet. Okay, we're gonna join a meeting and I will name it Translate. Okay, so once they are in the Meet, Turn this off and turn off my attendance. Okay, so once they're in the meet, you're going to have them open the chat. Anywhere over here in the chat, they're going to right click. Okay, and there will be a spot down here that says translate to Espanol. When you click on that, it'll pop up here. Well, it's actually going to say translate if it's the first time doing it. Since I did it before, I already have two options in there. They can then choose from the three dots, the snowman here. They can choose another language, and there is a long list of languages that they can choose from that they need it translated to. Um, I will leave it as Spanish for now, and I'm gonna hit done. So now everything here is going to come up in Spanish. Um, again, as the teacher, I wanna leave mine in English, but the student will see it in Spanish. Okay, once they've switched it, you cannot, if you notice, it's grayed out here. They can't switch back during the meet. They would have to leave and come back in for it to reset back to English. Um, okay, so now anything that gets typed in the chat, so if I want to say good morning to my students, good morning to everyone, notice it automatically switches into Spanish. Um, what they can do is hear this, I don't speak Spanish, but Activar Subtitulos. I'm assuming this is the closed captions. And when they turn the closed captions on, okay, if you notice, as I speak, the closed captions are changing from English to Spanish, and that will be on their end. Okay, um, I hope this helped. Like I said, the teacher should leave the language in English, but the student can translate it over into the language that they need. Hope this helped.